Alright, well, let's go get in some trouble here. So I watched back the first episode a little bit. Uh, it seems like the jitter I get in game is like rendering lag in the headset or something. It doesn't seem to be present in the recording, which is recording, you know, the screen. So that's good. At least looks good for you. It's not enough to get in the way of playing as long as it doesn't happen during combat. Hi. This is really weird that you're here in a weird white floaty person. Okay, training ground. It's a tutorial part two, I guess. Learn, learn how to kill. So I guess this is the exit. There. Okay, why is my body <laughs> not aligning? Oh no, that's the exit. That's why the man is sitting there. That makes perfect fucking sense. The man does symbolize the exit. Also, <laughs> what was it? Why did I say symbolize that way? You just heard the signal that the mission objective has been completed. Thank you. Take the tablet. I should have read the rest of that because apparently it's going to fucking disappear. Can I... Fuck. <laughs> okay. Mental note. Uh, read everything before doing anything. What's this? Oh, probably play tapes. Okay, uh, working theory. We're going, we're going that way. <laughs> uh, maybe. So that's, there's a little, like, centerpiece to the anomaly. Very pretty. Very cool. Okay, well, we see a bunch of stuff over that way. So I guess that's where we're going. Weird that the, uh, all these anomalies are like fucking chairs. I feel like they need a little more variance in their design. Ash is an anomalous substance that can be identified by its sound, dissolves in your hands, and converts to supply credits. Try grabbing it. Well, that's really weird. That's just a way for you to get money in the environment. I don't know, that feels, whoa, a little jitter, a little jitter. That feels a little contrary to um, the ethos of the first game where you had to scavenge loot, haul it back, and turn it in to get money. If I can just collect ash for credits, like. Okay, yeah, I'm getting some more jitter here on this building. Is that specifically the node that knocks back? Or is that... Because the, the, they talked about the sound cue, but I wasn't really paying attention. I think it's different, right? That's just the node. That bin down there looks suspicious. Some cigarettes. A lighter. Fuck. Okay. Eh, 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 eh. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> Probably easier just to walk away from it. Because, uh... Putting it back over the shoulder gets a little weird sometimes. All the fucking blood water is upsetting. Why are the oceans all blood now? Or the lakes? What is a lake but a small ocean? Cool vista. I'm gonna have to resist the urge to make the radius the thumbnail of every fucking episode. Yeah, the building, the building is a problem. My backpack is like extra far behind my shoulder for some reason. Okay. I don't know why my body was pushing away from the backpack when I was trying to put shit in there. More crackers. Oh, well, the backpack's still over there. Yeah, I don't... There's some bad flickering with the light. And some, like, major blurriness. Let me... Tinker. I didn't do this... Before. Oh, we're over, we're over in medium by default. Let's drop the resolution a notch. We're gonna do this very piecemeal. That way we don't have to, we don't overshoot too much fixing it. That seems a little bit better already. I don't even know if that'll affect, is that? No, that's the ash. So I guess the ash is just the... Yeah, like the burning sound. The ringing sound is just the other anomalies. Yeah, the whenever I bend over... Oh, I know what it is. It's because cause the game, when I bend over... My body moves with my head, not with my body. This is what? Full metal jacket rifle ammo, 762. So if I need to bend to the side maybe? Well, that still moves the headset, which is the fundamental issue. I wonder if you could cook up an algorithm. Oh, we've got... Uh, Tutorial paint there, it looks like. I, okay, so some people get really mad about this shit. Like, white paint, or in this case, orange paint, to, like, signify, you can go through the thing. I don't hate it inherently, but in a game like this, I don't like it. It's all about, like, the level of respective immersion for me. What is beeping? Maybe the roof? There is a thing up there. I saw Radius doing lightnings.
Oh, is this like our objective? This like beacon? I don't feel any compelling reason to go back yet. Uh, this probably doesn't hurt, right? <laughs> Let's do one of these. Do we... I wonder if we have any... What is our inventory limit? Maybe that black bar shows the total? We're at like 40%? 35%? Surely there's a mission log. Okay, there's more glowies there, so I think they want us to go back. Is there not a proper mission log? Like in the like in the pad? Is that what this is up here? Ah, there we go. You've lost the item, use the map to what? Lost item. Deliver the decommissioned equipment and complete the mission. So is this the generic description? Yeah, the item's still in here. All right. I have precisely zero interest in just heading straight back to base. <laughs> I want to fucking explore, man. Okay, it's running pretty good now that we dropped the resolution by 10%. Which probably makes sense if it's like headset resolution and it, the lag is in the system, not the game. Oh god. Weird, when I look like right down, it's much darker. Then when you look out, you get the reflections. The reflections track the head movement. Is there... I was gonna say, were there fucking, like, tentacles in there? No, it's just the way the waves look. Truck loot? Can I, uh... Nope. No opening of doors. Don't see anything in the boat. Ash on the rock. Looks like they might have different sizes, too. That one seemed bigger. Oh, well, fuck it. <laughs> okay, so there's like no other like landmarks here. There's like that dock over there, but I don't see any reason to go check that out. There's like these little things there. Those dotted lines. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's the grass. I was like... I think the, uh, the, the sound design for the grass needs a little work. It sounds like rattlesnakes and it's very loud in like the audio mix. It feels, it feels like it should be quieter moving through grass. But maybe it's got some sort of uh, negative repercussions for stealth. And then that's why the audio cue is so high. The water does sound very, very gross, which is great. Oh, maybe the dotted lines of the fences. Bunch of ash on this guy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, the ash thing doesn't, I don't like it. I don't like having to arbitrarily hunt around the environment for like little nodules of money. I like check the ruins, scavenge, you know, guns and cigarettes and sell those for money. Thought I heard something maybe drop. Construction site should have some uh, useful shit, you would think. So that's the thing there, right? Yeah, pretty sure. Oh god! It's our first combat engagement, and I'm a bitch baby, so I'm gonna make a save state. I hate you. Oh, oh, oh. Now, okay, if I duck in get like IRL, I stop. I just stop moving. So that's a problem. Oh God! Stop. Like I have this instinct to duck, which is a problem. What if I am standing in duck? That's not great either. Hmm. Yeah, it's fired an inconsistent amount of shots. Stop fucking locking me in place if I duck a little bit. Dude, I hate that. Is he moving? I'm gonna die. Oh, cool. I wasn't prepared for his fucking body to ascend. What the shit? That's dope as fuck. Okay, anyway. <laughs> Do we use. We have two fucking bullets. We're just gonna chuck you in there. Because it's dark and I don't trust myself to not fucking drop some shit. Didn't we have a spare ready to go? Well, I had a whole ass second gun ready to go. That's what it was. I remember. All right. Well, fuck me. Not the best first combat, but the whole like crouch movement thing really fucked my day up. That's something we'll have to play with. If I just, yeah, even if I, if I manually move and I get too low, it locks me in fucking place. I hate that. I really hate that. 
That's actually a problem. Like, that's legitimately very frustrating. I can't go down. Hello? There's nothing here with Crouch. Gameplay? No, it's just Vinette turn, Vinette run. Fuck. Wait, I don't, I really don't like that. Well, I guess we'll just have to live with it and get used to it, if we can. Oh, you bitch. I knew it was there, I just didn't realize it was this side of the fence. All right, let's go back, loot this construction site, and then maybe we need to leave, because we're at 25% health. I'd like to, I'd probably prefer to use a shower for healing back at base rather than uh, use a med thing. Just assuming that would, you know, game balance wise be the better financial decision. You would assume. Is that a, the sun came up beep? Cause it did seem like the sun came up. What's the beep? Oh, wait a second. I do. Oh God. <laughs> Don't really want to shoot it. <laughs> it's weird, weirdly just like floating. <laughs> this is clearly going to be another mission, right? All right, well, I guess we leave that be. I just able to like kind of skip ahead here in the tutorial is that what we did I'll just leave that there because I don't trust it not to drop shit if I put it over my shoulder more action this way, seemingly.
starting to think we should probably just go back. Let's check this shit here. And then leave. Yeah, like, I don't know, man. How am I supposed to look down anything? What if I'm crouched? That doesn't do shit for me. <laughs> All right. Hello? Well, this looks very distinctly like a thing in the environment that's relevant, and yet it does not appear to be anything. Okay, we got ash. Let's be this way. Oh, there. Fuck. Anomalous teacup. Okay, that's kind of sick. Getting away from the uh, the straight up abstract anomalies and into like, here's a fucking magic teacup. That's pretty cool. I'll have to do some bullet consolidation when we get back. So I'm like up on the ledge above the entry point, I think. Is there anything else here? No. So, I mean, there's some cool stuff so far in this game. There's a few changes I'm not a huge fan of initially. Um, but also, at the end of the day, like... The, the first game still exists. So, if there's stuff I prefer in the first game, I can always just play the first game. Right? These waving dudes are always weird to me. There was some text there. Maybe we should have looked at it. Why did it make a noise? <laughs> That's why it made a noise. My gun is out of my fucking back. Fucking backpack. I do distinctly remember a few times in the first game uh, losing items on transition. If they were not, like, properly stored, or if I was, like, holding them, sometimes they'd just disappear or uh, po possibly go sailing into oblivion. Okay, we got stuff going on in here now. Let's, uh, let's head over here take a look. <clears throat> What's up? Jesus. Tide meter. Okay, can you fucking... That's so loud. Jesus. Okay, so we still have the tide. Brings back uh, all dangerous and valuable entities. Tide catches you. Seek a shelter or leave the radius to avoid getting killed. Oh, not just like relocated, but fucking killed? Just straight up fucking death is uh, pretty mean. Okay. What the fuck are you doing there? All right, let's take stock. You can stay. Not you. Not you. You. Not you. <laughs> well, you can stay here too. One of you. You go here. You come with me. You go here. 
Cigarettes. Let's go investigate selling shit. Why did the, do you hear that? <laughs> there was like a fan audio and then it like cut out. What the fuck was that about? PM mags. Yep. No visible difference in anything. Do I, I think we keep these for now. I think five magazines is technically viable. Keep a spare lighter. Do these have condition? Because this one looks beat up. Good old lighter. Maybe it's just the other side of the texture. It looks a little beat than the one side. Yeah, that's the same. Okay, crackers. Do we... Even think we need a lighter though. Like, do we have any evidence that matters? And the same token, do we have any evidence that eating anything is anything? I feel like we don't. I feel like perhaps these don't do anything yet. <laughs> I like that I can reload the uh, the cracker box. We'll stock them in case they do start mattering. At some point, we'll organize this shit when we have enough stuff that it feels like organizing matters. Okay. Uh... Holding A and pressing grip. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. There's our total weight limit. Cool. Check it on the blue indicator. Uh... So we can have, so you can just have multiple kits. Oh, that's kind of fucking sick, actually. So you could have, like, preset loadouts, like if you're going to go out in a big firefight versus an exploratory trip, basically. That's pretty cool. How do I get this back? There we go. We need two flashlights. Uh, okay. So backpack is nearly full. Chest rigs at half. How's a backpack nearly full? We had like other shit in it before. I guess the shit we did have in it, a few bullets and crackers, was enough to just get it like right up to the limit maybe. Uh, we got the rest spot. Uh, how do we know when the tide is coming? Because, like... Yeah, like what tells us the tide timer? Because we should it it should be universal. Two days, zero hours. Is this it? I bet you it is, right? Because that's where the alarm is. So two days, zero hours to tide. So probably the tide just kicked in, so to speak. That'd be my guess. 
Okay, now what? Do I... Outdated UNSPC sensor mission item. Okay. That's worth 75. Empty box. It's worth 10. Isn't this? Is this just not enabled currently? Fuck. Do we have to get to this in the tutorial? It's kind of obnoxious. Well, then what the fuck am I supposed to be doing? If that works. What? Wait, this one just doesn't work. Why the fuck doesn't the, why does only one of these work? Weird. get it oh that's just go back to map deliver the decommissioned equipment sample to facility 27 and complete the mission is that not Hello? <laughs> Ready to complete? Yes? Wait, complete. Okay, weird. It has to be in my hand. That's so weird. Thank you for your hard work. Great. Pending mission. Demonstration skills using probes, artifact actor, ingenuity, and mine artifacts. Accept. Goal, essence artifact, S312. Use probes, use a detector, detect the artifact nest. Which is probably the thing we saw. Reward security level increase, credits, and a shoddy. Sick. Why is my... There it goes. Okay, I'm gonna leave the pistol here. I don't think we I don't think I need to bring the spare. We're still in tutorial land. I think I'm I'm better off just not, you know.
15 out of 15, six. Put the crackers in the fridge, duh. Where else would you put your fucking crackers? Oh, they make little rattly noises. Oh, that's fun. Oh, you're not a fucking, fucking mag. Ugh. Rifles, pistols. I know I said I was going to do this later, but now I'm like, I'm in the zone. Auto zone. Sorry. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> uh, I guess that shit could stay there. I don't really feel like... I wonder if this is a usable like weapon rack. Like, if you can just chuck your long arms in here. That was something the first game was missing, was proper weapon racks. I mean, judging by the fact that they got the, uh, the backpack and armor racks, I bet you those are weapon racks. E even if they're not functional yet, I bet you that's kind of the, the intent. Do you have racks in here? You know what? Workbenches. Workbenches with clamps. Weapon maintenance. My precious. I bet you. I bet you. Weapon maintenance is is, if not active currently, planned to be a thing. It's possible for the tutorial section. Like it just doesn't kick in. How's our, how's our height today? Ugh. Worse when that happens. Uh, yeah, not quite the correct scale. I just got really big hips. And my arms come out of my fucking armpits. It's fine. It's not unplayable. Like, it's wrong, but it's not so wrong that it, like breaks immersion or like fucks things up the big thing is the hands being in the right place is the big thing like i don't look at my shoulders to realize they're low oh interesting shit's getting wacky A little more of a puzzle element. Should we assume it's in the direction we were before? Probably. I'm just gonna put this back. It looks like uh, maybe nothing's respawned. Which makes sense, the tide hasn't come in yet. my IRL. I'm still pretty centered. In my place space. I supposed to do? Oh my god, please. Use probes to check for anomalies, use detector. Do we... I wanted to do. Oh, 
That ain't doing it. Okay, shooting it was actually the thing. I don't know what was supposed to explicitly tell us we're supposed to shoot it, but... In progress, find the nest in the cluster. Oh, there's a, okay, we got a location specifically. Okay, we're not even there yet. That's a bonus. It seemed like there was another one up on the ridge. So yeah, these are just bonus loot. I understand. Jesus. might be it. Oh, just take it. More full metal jacket. We'll gladly take that. Anything up here? Doesn't look like it. Is that an artifact? One of those. So what would be the, the like, does this actually help you? I guess it guarantees that you have time to move past, right? And then you go, ah, fucking still got got. Individual cigarettes, but then the cigarette magazine. K-74. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Is this empty? Oh, fuck. These things run out. Well, I was just fucking burning that shit like it was infinite, like in the first game. I mean, it makes sense that it would run out. Uh, I feel like, so it's like empty shells that are used in that. So I kind of feel like, you know, it should just kind of reload.
Well, now I gotta fucking remember my own way out of here. Isn't there a thing here? Don't move. I can hear it there. There's a chair there. Shit. Almost got me. This is not the way we came in, but it's the way I'm going. Don't remember seeing anything on the ridge itself, so I think once we're here, we're safe. Does this have charge? No, flashlight just, just seems to be a flashlight. So this is the intended approach, probably. Nothing going on. So those are both. Yep, there we go. Uh, I don't th see anything that looks like a reason to keep going that way. So we're not gonna. Oh shit. You little shits again! Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh my god. Seriously. Fuck off! What the fuck? What? Is the fucking. Why did it not shoot before? Dude, how do you beat these in this game? You gotta wait till they jump. Okay, we're just gonna die. I don't know why the gun wasn't working. One twenty three auto. What the fuck was that, dude? I don't know if the Oh God. Dude, these are a nightmare. What the fuck are you talking about? Bro, what the fuck? How in the fucking fuck did I not hit it? I need a knife. Like... I did hit it, that's why the little sparks are there, but like... Dude, how much fucking... What the fuck? Dude, this sucks. <laughs> Why is it the worst thing to deal with now? <laughs> Fucking dog shit, dude. What the fuck? Okay, I also need to, like, basically end because my controllers... Like, my, my hands are getting a little sweaty. Which is causing... What the fuck? Oh yeah, because there's two already. Yeah, you could see like the delay there, me trying to uh, release shit. Also, uh, this this doesn't work with the index controllers for shit. Uh, whoops. God damn it. Motherfuck.
The body shifting is a problem. The fuck did that bullet go? Come on, drop the fucking flashlight. Drop the flashlight. I picked up the wrong fucking mag. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Jesus fuck. Also worse that it's in the fucking dark. I'm sure we'll get used to those things. Uh this sucks, <laughs> though. This was really bad. Just wait till they fucking stop moving and unload in that point blank, I guess. I ain't got the time to... I ain't, I ain't used to aiming for shit yet. I guess we'll fucking save. If I could put the flashlight back on my goddamn vest. I, I think we better end here. I need to mop my hands, I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs>